Good morning, St. Thomas More. I'm just here to talk to you about uh, t tomorrow's prom, but also we can kind of think of it forward going into semi-formal. I want to talk about the ground rules at an event like this. So uh, first of all, I hope you're excited about it. Uh, we are excited to put it on for you. It's really our first event like this in three years. We've had unprecedented demand, so it should be a good night. And I, I really hope that you have a great time. And for some of you, it uh, you know replaces the elementary grad you maybe missed. And it's a fun time. It's a formal setting. It's a dinner dance. It, it should be great. Uh, but there are school rules, and I need to go through them here. You have to understand that even though this is off-site, it's a school event. And since it's a school event, all school rules do apply. And so at the door, you're going to be subject to security screening. We're going to have staff there, um, both uh, security staff, police people, also adults, uh, teachers, and administration. Um, everything's going to be searched on the way in and things that are obviously not permitted in the classroom are not permitted here at this event including vapes so if you do carry a vape leave it at home uh, make sure obviously anything any anything that would put you under the influence uh, is not permitted in in this event and I want to go through what happens and I really hope it doesn't but if something does if we do discover these things what happens next well, if you happen to be trying to bring something like that into the um, event or you arrive under the influence yourself, you're going to be removed from the event, your parents are going to be called, you're going to be picked up immediately, and then on top of it, when you get to school the next day, you're going to be dealing with school level consequences and potentially legal consequences. All in all, it's going to ruin your night, so don't do it. Uh, the event ends at 11 p.m. We're asking you to make sure your parents are aware of that so they're not leaving their house at 11 but they're actually arriving at 11 and I encourage you all St. Thomas More students to just be teenagers at these events enjoy the time uh, and and have a good time get dressed up have fun but it's our job to make sure it gets done safely we take that very seriously as we have all year with all our events and finally before I sign off I do want to recognize and I hope the students recognize the extreme amount of effort that the adults put in to make these things happen uh, it's these things are all volunteer activities they love doing it for you but the um, the payback is watching our students have a good time have a clean time follow the rules as laid out so I'm asking you to cooperate with that and I hope you have a wonderful time we'll see you there tomorrow night for those of you who are attending for those of you who are not have a great day at St. Thomas More